Hi guys, so today I wanted to do a video where I give you some tips on ways you can wash your stuffed animals because I want to show you guys a few different ways to do that because as you guys might know, I have a lot of stuffed animals. You don't need to wash them a lot, especially if most of the time they're in your room, but I tend to take mine places sometimes. I'll bring them with me to the store or I'll have them on my car or something like that and in that case you do need to wash them also if like maybe one sleeps in your bed with you a lot then maybe you need to wash that one paul i used to take with me in the car pretty much every single day he got a little smelly when, when i did this so we needed to wash him and the way that we did that was we just used some baby shampoo on a damp washcloth and we wiped him down and that is basically how we washed him and then we let him air dry we also like used a blow dryer for your hair on him as well and then he was you know super clean baby shampoo made him smell super good so that was a good idea as for pierre um this is pierre one of my squishmallows i uh renamed this one to be pierre but he actually got something sticky on him so we had to clean that and my mom used something to help me get it out that i'm pretty sure she'd use dish soap like dawn dish soap and we scrubbed on the spot that was sticky and then i'm pretty sure we also put pierre in the washing machine and i was very worried uh, because, you know, washing machines can be, like, uh, harsh, <laughs> and I was really worried that Pierre would get, um, damaged or not be as soft, but, you know, it worked out pretty well. I think we washed on cold, and Pierre is still very soft, feels like a normal, just, like, fresh-bought Squishmallow, and look, looks good as new, so clean and, and, and nice, so it worked really well to do that for Pierre. I'm pretty sure we just used the washing machine and then the regular clothes dryer, so, uh, that did worry me a bit, but it, it worked perfectly for Pierre and got the stickiness out and Pierre is back to back to good as new. <laughs> this is Contract, my little dinosaur. And since people ask, Contract is from Target and Paul came from Five Below and Pierre came from a Hallmark store where they have lots of squishmallows. If you took your stuffed animal into the car and he just got really smelly like Paul did, um, then, you know, using a light shampoo that smells really good, like a baby shampoo, was a really great idea for that. And also, if you got something sticky, dish soap seemed to work for that. And also, just using the regular washing machine and dryer is also an easier way if you want to wash your stuffed animals. I just don't like to do that a lot. <laughs> for mine, I don't want to have to put them in the dryer and washer and stuff. I just like to, like, clean them more delicately <laughs> if you took your stuffed animal into like a store or something with you or if you got your stuffed animal at a store and it's like new since there's coronavirus i think it's important to disinfect them like you don't want to get any of that coronavirus germs on you so um i don't know if this is like 100 percent but like disinfectant sprays are supposed to get 99.9 percent .9 of the germs so hopefully you know it's safe uh for covid purposes <laughs> one thing that i've done before is I will use those disinfectant wipes, like surface wipes, and I will use those and wipe down my stuffed animal. And then another way is just to spray them with this disinfectant spray like this. You can use any kind, so it doesn't really matter what brand. Um, just spray them all over, and they'll be super clean and they won't have germs. Ta-da! <laughs> those are the three to four ways that I clean my stuffed animals. One, using baby shampoo. Two, using like a dish soap. Three, using a washing machine and dryer with just regular laundry detergent for using um, disinfectant spray or wipes. Melvin, by the way, he came from the dollar section at Target. Contract came from just like the regular toys slash stuffed animal section for $10, I think. But Melvin was like two or three dollars, so really good deal. And he feels and uh, squishes like a Squishmallow, so that's really awesome. That is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching it, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!